You are a universe unto yourself. You are one of an infinite number of possibilities. Therefore, you are unique. Knowing this, we seek to find those who share qualities in common or highlight the fact that we are so different from everyone else. In this way, we build relationships and emphasize individuality. We exist in cycles of imagining and becoming, adapting and evolving, programming ourselves as situations warrant. The question is whether we choose to do this consciously or unaware. Most people do this without a thought about what they are putting into their minds. They blame circumstances rather than their thinking as it connects to their actions or lack of actions and in defining who they are. Instead, we can self-reflect on what we are watching or what is happening during our day instead of always waiting until later. Ask yourself, what did you learn? How did it make you better, stronger, smarter, wiser, or was it just time wasted? And we accept that putting good food into our bodies plus exercise equals good health. Then shouldn't the same be true of our minds? If you fill your thoughts with nonsense and meaningless things, what words will spill from your lips? On what basis will you try to connect with others? What references will you pull from? What associations will you make? If we fill ourselves with worrisome thoughts, won't we be more likely to worry about things? If we fill ourselves with thoughts of happy things, won't it be easier to find reasons to be happy? The world is filled with sorrow and suffering, which should not be ignored. But if our thoughts are always on these things, how difficult will it be to separate ourselves from these heavy emotions and detach them from our lives? We generalize and compartmentalize because it is easier instead of viewing experiences independently and choosing how the information should be best processed and stored within our beings. The value of things is not always evident on the surface. We must assign value to things with intent. The intent of being the best version of ourselves so we can encourage others to do the same. The more value we derive from our experience, the more potential we have to grow.